Welcome to Genogram Analytics. This first instructional video is how to create a new genogram. First, we select from File, New Genogram. Then we enter the title of the new genogram. We're going to call this one New Genogram. Saying OK, we'll bring up the index person. And we're going to call the index person Tom. Male, he was born on 3 3 19 55. And by clicking OK, we now have put the index person in the center of the genogram and ready to proceed. Okay, by clicking on the symbol of the person, we now bring up the lower menu and we see we have attributes, displayable attributes on the bottom. Row, this is important, this is the toolbar. And we have comments, secrets, add parents, add spouse, professional, add institution, pet. And later we'll talk about interpersonal relations. First we're going to click on here and we'll add parents. And we'll click on Tom again and we'll add a spouse. And it assumes that it'll be a opposite sex, but that can be changed. Uh, to add children, we click on a couples line. To add a single child, we can just click on the add sim son symbol. And if we want to add children at the same time, we click on the line again. And we'll use the add children function. This was the one that we've already added. And we'll add two more. Let's make these female. And we'll make them twins. And so we'll make them twins by selecting in the multiple birth the same color and if they're identical we would also select the same color in the last column so we'll say okay and now we have a son and a younger female twins identical that's what this means in order to create an interpersonal relationship I click on a person and then I click on a type of relationship and this we're going to click close and we'll say Tom was close with his mother. If I want to add a attribute then I can click on person we'll say Tom again and we'll go attributes edit attributes and this is going to bring up let's say he has education level of bachelors and let's say he has an illness of diabetes. His occupation is blue collar. And we'll say OK. And we see that we now have attributes, little dots, the category and the type. That's a little bit in the way, so I'm going to pull this down. And we can move this a little bit under him. There. And up in the upper left, we've developed a key for the attributes and a key for the interpersonal relations. And this ends our first video.